Now, you may have seen them through your balconies, windowsills, or even inside your home. They're called midges. Yeah, and those tiny insects seem to be out in bigger numbers than usual this season. Shannon Martin is out on the bug beat, and she's joining us live tonight. Shannon, why are they so bad this year? Well, Emery, it's the weather. All the rain this summer meant the bugs were getting busy. There's a lot of dead guys all over the floor here. Here, there, everywhere, piles of dead bugs. You can really see them. Yeah, they like it in this area. For this law student, they are uninvited roommates, bugs that first showed up weeks ago. At first, I thought maybe I spilled something, so I tried to clean up a little bit, but that didn't help. They just kept coming. The teeny tiny mosquito-like flies are called midges. Their population is now sky high because of all that rain this past summer. Since May, 430 millimeters drenched the GTA. That's one and a half times more than normal. Perfect breeding grounds that had midges mating and multiplying by the millions. This is just overnight. This entomologist says what uh, makes midges particularly problematic for homeowners is their love of light. So when the sun goes down, they head indoors. Even if, if there is tiny crack in a window or door, or you just go to the backyard and come back again, uh, you will see tens of them uh, fly in, in, inside. A nuisance for sure, but fortunately, that's it. The pests are parasite-free and pose no health risk. If they are inside, they are not going to survive probably 24 hours, even less, much less. The midges never made it inside Dan Rosman's condo. With no access to standing water, they all died, leaving behind one big mess. A lot of cleaning up and then just staying inside? Yeah, exactly. So, I mean, they're not here today. Hopefully, they're not coming back. So how did the bugs get all the way up to his condo, the 26th floor? Our entomologist says it's just the breeze. The bugs are so lightweight that the wind from the lake will literally take them up that high. How do you get rid of the bugs or at least keep them from getting inside your house? Our bug expert says try to keep your windows and doors as closed as much as possible. Or you can try putting double-sided tape around the frames. Hopefully that'll catch them before they head inside, guys. Yeah, all right, Shannon, thanks very much.